Hello, big beautiful world called planet Earth. I'm not going to talk about teams today in the sporting world, but I will talk about sports in general. Because I believe every single person on this planet, whether they played sports or not, are entertained by it. Whether it's, it's baseball, whether it's NFL, whether it's hockey, whether it's soccer, whether it's um, gymnastics, whether it's... Um, uh, what other sports are there? Um, base, and I just said baseball. Uh, volleyball. Um, any sport that exists can be entertained to a certain extent to certain individuals. And I'm not trying to uh, be derogatory or anything like this. Like, in, gymna in gymnastics or in any Olympic sport, it could be bobsledding, it could be um, skiing, snowboarding, skateboarding, um, and, and, and it could be outside of that world as well. And there's, there's certain individuals in this world, like myself, who like to, to watch baseball or like to watch football or to like to watch basketball or, or, and sometimes I like to watch the Olympics and see what, you know, and it's not just, it's not just, um, and it could be softball too. It's not just men's sports that I watch. It's women's sports as well. You know, I'm not too familiar with uh, women basketball or too familiar with um, too familiar with any other, you know, women's sports that could be, you know, uh, rugby or things like that. There, so in gymnastics, I like to watch, you know, both men and women. And I like to watch softball from time to time. I like to watch women and men's soccer. Um... And there's nothing wrong with that, by the way. I don't know why everyone thinks that, you know, watching a man's sport and a woman's sport is bad a bad thing. There are so many great things about women's soccer. There's so many great things about women's gymnastics. There's so many great things about uh, softball, which can be played both by men and women. Um, same thing with the NBA, the W women's NBA or women's college basketball or... Um, what, uh, there's not, I mean, there's a few women who've been partaking in football and there's women, uh, rugby, uh, teams, there's women boxing, there's, you know, and I'm not just, I'm not trying to explain to you guys that there's anything right or wrong with, um, watching these sports because there's not. Everyone likes their own version of sports, whether it's women's sports or whether it's men's sport, or they can like both. That's what I'm trying to get at. Um, and there's bobsledding, there's women's racing, um, or women that have been part of, you know, whether it's NASCAR or Formula One or things of that nature, or women, like I said, I mentioned women's sports in general. Every single uh, individual likes to watch both men and women's sports. And I'm not going to go into like full detail of every single woman's sport I've ever watched or every single, uh, and it could be wrestling, it could be um, um, anything that has to do with sports related stuff. And it's not, and it's, and it, it's not just, it's not just, you know, women and men's sports. It could be w men acting and men, women acting, or it could be women musicians or men musicians, um, or... Uh, women's social media influencers and men's social media influencers, whether you watch YouTube videos or um, or anything really basically that exists in this world that women and men, in my opinion, and this is just my opinion, this would be controversial, and I'm trying not to be, uh, to like I mentioned yesterday's vlog, that I lean more towards watching women on YouTube and and on and following uh, women actresses and women musicians and things of that nature. Don't get me wrong though. I do follow men on you know I do watch men on YouTube and I do follow men on Instagram and all that stuff. But I follow more women, and there's nothing absolutely nothing wrong with that because I'm single and I plan to be single for a long time, and I don't want to be in a relationship at least for right now. That, that may change in about a year or may change in about uh, five years, whatever it is, or maybe 10 years, whatever it is. But I'm more interested in women than I am with men. Um, 
on social media, per se. Um, in sports, I like to watch both. I like to watch women's sports and I like to watch men's sports. Um, so it's really, it really depends on how I'm feeling that specific day. Um, but for the most part, I follow more, I, I, I watch uh, more women, I follow more women um, than I do with men on social media. But for sports and for music and for all these other things, I, I like to say it's equal. Um, but that's just me personally. I'm not saying that every single person is going to agree or uh, be on the same boat with me in that situation. I'm just saying that's for me personally to decide who I, who I follow more than other one gender over another gender or watch a specific sport with one gender over another or music or movies or TV shows or things of that nature. You know, it's really, it, I like to be open-minded basically on that specific thing, unless it's social media, then it's a completely different realm of things. Um, so that's where I wanted to go with today's vlog. And I know that it may sound controversial, but I'm trying not to be in this vlog. With that being said, uh, there's a couple of things else. So um, three days from now, uh, so today's Friday, on Monday I'm turning 34. So we're only three days away from my 34th birthday. Um, I don't know what the full plan is for that day. I definitely know we're going out to do family dinner. Um, I may be going to see a movie that day. I may not. I'll uh, probably open presents. If I get any, I'm not saying I'm going to. Um, and then and then from there, it's all about planning my next birthday, which is a big birthday for me personally. Um, so with that being said, let's talk about birthdays today. So I want to wish um, uh, Maria Bruno a happy birthday, Abigail Breslin a happy birthday, and who's the other one? I'd have to look here for a second. Um, uh, Josephine Scriver Carlson Dion, De uh, a happy 30th birthday today. And then we've got um, a bunch of birthdays tomorrow. We've got three, six, six birthdays, or well, really, no, yeah, it's six. Um, six birthdays tomorrow, even though one is, is the same on uh, YouTube as it is on um, Instagram. So with that being said, stay happy, stay upbeat, be who you want to be and do what you want to do with your life. Uh, find your love story and I will see you tomorrow with a brand new vlog. Bye-bye.